All right, today we're going to talk about Kahoot and what account to get. If you want to get the most out of a Kahoot account, go for the teacher. Even if you're not a teacher, it will make a huge difference. So let me go into Teacher by clicking on it. Right. And then you describe your workplace. Well, um, let's just add school. But actually, I'm higher education. But you can add whatever you want. Next, notice it's creating my account. And then it asks for money. But I'm going to go for the free. How do I do that? Let me show you. First of all, I get all these prices that I'm not going to relate to. Let me just accept all cookies. Going to go into basic for free. You do not need to pay to create challenges and do other things. You might be limited, but you can still create challenges. And that's what this is about, creating challenges for others to do at their own pace and time so that it's not in real time. All right, so there we go. Now we're in. We didn't have to add our age or anything like that, that students do have to add and that can cause problems. Next, I'm going to go into Create. Really easy, Create. So let's click on that. Notice I can also create a course as a teacher. I've got lots of options here, and they're all free. So we're going to go into Create, click on it. Notice what we've got here, a Kahoot or a course. I'm going to go for a Kahoot. I want to create a Kahoot challenge. So let me... Uh, decide which one I want to do and just hit create for this purpose. Just going to demonstrate and then um, I'm going to add questions. So let's look for media too. Okay, there's media and my first question. And this is where I add the question. Very intuitive with lots of information on the page. We can which can be quite confusing, of course. So my question is, what has a green color and is a fruit? Okay, I'm sure there are lots of fruits, but I'm gonna have only one. And the answer is, apple okay a green apple let's put green to make it easier on people so green apple and then another answer is red apple just to see if people are reading red apple another one is yellow yeah there are apples that are yellow yellow apple and for the fourth answer i'm going to write none of the above right now which is the correct answer this one so i'll mark it notice with a v all right next i'm going to say that's all just one question i hope it works with one question it may not i may need to have at least three but let me try it all right, so there I'm going to save it. Important to save. And cross your fingers. There, I'm going to give it a title. I'm going to call it Apples and no description. Next, I'm going to hit continue. You can see that continue. Changes saved. Right. Now I need to create the challenge. Challenge is homework. It's not time-based, as I said before, which is great. Next, as I said, this is not very intuitive. You really have to go through a lot of distractions here to get to what you want. Next one is share. We want to share it. I'm going to click on share. And then we've got two options. We're going to assign this. It doesn't say challenge yet, but, oh, it does. There's the word challenge. Great. All right, we're going to assign it. Click on Assign. We're not done yet. Now we're going to 
select. I only have one, so that's the only one. All right, next, randomize answer order. There's only one. Nickname generator, not going to do that, but maybe I should. Okay, let's generate. All right, next is very important since uh, I want to have plenty of time. Let me go into the date. Today is the 10th. Well, they want it to be to the 10th. Today is the 7th. So let me open that up so we can go into the end of the month. Okay, August 30th. And then, of course, the time. Uh, let's make it 11 p.m. at the end of the day. Why not? Right? And then I click on Create. We're not done yet. So let's click on Create. Lots of Create here, right? And here we are. There it comes. Now we're going to copy the URL. Notice all the information on this page. Very, very distractive. Okay, now we're going to copy the link so we can add it and share it wherever we want. We don't need the pin because the pin is actually on it. Okay, copied. We copied it. Now we're going to go into the course. In this case, it's uh, one of my courses. So let me go into it and um, let me scroll up till I get to the introductions. I'm going to introduce myself. Let me scroll down. You don't have to have Moodle or a course to do this. You can do it in your social network. Share it anywhere by email or any other way. I'm going to add a topic. I'm going to write my challenge, the Apple challenge. And then I'm going to uh, paste the link. Since this is Moodle, it's really, really easy. So, And then I'm just going to post a forum. There we are, so we can see it. Scroll down so we can take a look at it. There we are. There's my name and my challenge and the date. I'm going to click on my challenge. And there it is. There's the challenge. Now, wait a minute, one more step. You can have as many Kahoot accounts as you want, and it might be a good idea to do that. You can have one as a student, and then compare it. What's it like as a student, even though you can create a challenge as a student as well. It's all the same. You just have to add your age. And sometimes teachers who become students forget, and then they can't do it. You have to be over the age of 16 in most parts of the world, and over the age of 13 in the United States to be able to create or share, create a challenger share. I'm going to click on my challenge and I'm in as another ID. And here we go. Here it is. So I can choose a nickname. I can spin. There it's spinning. That's what I want. And I've, I'm called Radiant Sable. Okay, go. That's who I am. And here's my challenge. Apples. One, two, three. And here we go. Here's the quiz. What has a green color and is a fruit? Wow, what do you think? Red apple? None of the above. Uh, wrong. And that's it. There's no next. I'm the only one. And I'll be able to get to see who came in first by copying the link down here. And it's open for 23 days. Sometimes you can actually uh, keep it there for longer by changing the dates each time so once you reach i don't know the 20th or whatever you just extend it so that's possible and there's the copy to see who comes in first right now i have zero because i didn't get anything and that said let me know if you have any questions about kahoot i'd love to help and i love kahooting bye for now